Inflation has made everyday essentials a lot more expensive, so if you have debt, paying that down is an even bigger challenge. As WMART News' Mallory Safaste explains this morning, there are options to help you get out of the red because if it matters to you, it's a matter for Mallory. You may feel like you're drowning in debt, but it's still possible to achieve a clean slate. A Maryland couple was able to do it with a debt management plan, paying down over $100,000 in credit card debt. For many, the math isn't adding up. Income is limited, but prices are soaring. And on top of that, you have a mound of bills. We have been struggling for many years. Over the years, Jane Spence and her husband accumulated over $100,000 in mostly credit card debt. They refinanced several times, but couldn't seem to catch up. We ended up using our 401k. And uh, I used some of mine and he used all of his. And so that's hurt us a lot. They then contemplated filing bankruptcy until they heard about a debt management plan. In a debt management program, the creditors agreed to reduce the interest rates down to an average of about 6.4% um, and have people on a plan to be out of debt within about four years on average. Money Management International administered the Spence's plan. Their eight credit cards were consolidated into one account. MMI negotiated the interest rate down to 7% and they paid $1,900 a month, allowing them to pay off all their debt. Total of 106000 Over which how is long? a lot in less than five years. There's a catch of sorts. You have to close those credit card accounts so you don't rack up any debt during the process. If you fall into old habits, you risk your creditors pulling out of the program. The credit counseling agency also is paid a fee. On average, client fees are about $24 a month. Um, there is a nominal startup fee that averages about $35. Plus, these agencies receive payments from creditors. What's called a fair share payment, basically in exchange for administering the debt per management program, the creditor also gives a percentage as well. So there's a vested interest from both parties in making sure it's successful. Debt management plans can also help save you thousands of dollars in interest. For example, if someone had $18,000 in debt and paid the same amount each month as they would on a plan, it potentially cost them $27,000 more over time. This plan, however, takes discipline. If it's not for you, there's debt consolidation. You get a new loan to consolidate high interest rate cards. But interest rates vary based on your credit score. The lower your score, the higher the rate. With debt settlement, a company negotiates down the amount you owe. Your credit, though, could tank while you withhold payments and hope that a settlement is reached. You also risk being sued by the creditor. Finally, there's bankruptcy. You ask a court to discharge your debts. This could have long-term impacts on your finances and could cost you any assets. While none may seem like a great option, they do offer a way out for consumers in over their heads. I think it really helped us a lot. You know, we got used to budgeting our money a little bit better. If we can help people get those interest rates and payments down on credit cards, that does free up money in their budget to be able to allocate to other real essential needs that they have. Debt management plans only cover unsecured debts, such as credit cards and personal loans, not mortgages or student loans. And you don't need a credit counseling agency to reduce your interest rates. Call your lender and see if they're willing to work with you. Then also speak with a counselor and see if they're able to get you a better rate. For WMAR 2 News, I'm Mallory Safaste.